this year was set to be the biggest in Driftmaster's history. Unfortunately, the world had other ideas. A full season was soon deemed impossible. But one event, one special event, well, that might just show the world the potential of what could have been. One event, one podium, one shot. Something special was about to happen in Riga. But we could only watch because some talented and nervous individuals had to go out there, put it all on the line to make it special. Riga is just so unique, you know, like it, you're drifting in a forest, like the locals are really nice. There's always such a good atmosphere here and the track is just insane. It's the fastest track of the year, usually, with it being the only track of the year, it's probably going to even be faster. The track is full throttle, it's really high commitment and puts you on the edge of the seat. It's the same for the fans that are watching and I think it's one of the most unique events in Europe. I'm expecting some high level drifting here. I'm also expecting some really cool cars and just a generally fast track and I'm so pumped for this. Well, a lot of people have told me that this track is quite scary. I heard a guy once rolled his car over. You have to just have your mindset and risk it for the biscuits. in these two runs where well, one of these guys is going to make, take a step into the final four and make their name in history. Puts it to the door. How do you 
possibly do better than that? How do you actually go out there without having a massive crash and do better than that? Take a breath, ladies and gentlemen, because we're about to watch something very special. Here we go again. It's all of a danger to the back of the day. missing around through the smoke. Comes Dean, but Shanahan absolutely flies Dean all open side of him. Wow, the transition. Dean gets left a little bit. Shanahan goes faster than Dean. And Dean's got to make a dive, but it's not as close. He's got to get the work done here on the last corner. And James Dean is on the ropes here. James Dean would win this battle, but on this day, I don't know. I don't know. Will it be Dean? Will it be Shanahan? It's James Dean getting the win and going through to the final. Adam Zalewski and Jack Shanahan, they are going to go out and go head-to-head -head in two almost identical vehicles for a third-place trophy. Zalewski right on the door of Shanahan as he's inch-perfect. Bam! On the transition, Zalewski makes a little wobble. In the chase position, he's got to get himself back into this battle. Shanahan running away with pace at the moment, and we expect it. Zalewski's in the smoke, he's out. As he spun out, he's spun out. Zalewski spins out in the smoke. Oh, Zalewski is Zalewski. furious, he cannot believe it. And Shanahan takes third step. The Einsek Dean's the final battle. Who is going to be crowned King of Riga? Will it be Fjainsek? Will it be Dean? And here we go. Oh. Dean with a massive entry, and he holds it. James Dean is all over the front wheel as they transition in front of the judging tower. James Dean makes another dive up to the wall. Dean gets into the house zone. Wow, Dean right up on the door. Gets it, gets it right the rear end off the wall there. Door to door. Fjainsek fires in behind Dean. Dean drops out of the outer zone, but now back in it. Peter Vincent kicks up some dust in front of the judges tower, gets back into the mix, onto the door he goes, it isn't as clean, but James Dean on the wall and across the line, takes the towel line out of the back of that Eurofighter. Unbelievable scenes right here in Latvia. What happened in Riga on August 15th, 2020 will forever be remembered. Not just for the incredible driving and action, but for the challenges that surrounded it even happening. In the midst of worldwide chaos and negativity, a drift event brought us back together as fans. Whether you watch from the stands or from your couch, you were part of it. We all were. It made us all remember why we love this sport, why we love this series. And this was just a showcase. This was just a teaser of what's to come. But be honest, it got you excited, right? Mission accomplished.